hello guys welcome back to the channel this message is for taurus so we're gonna do a reading to see what's going on with you and your person taurus if you guys are new here remember to like the video give this video a big thumbs up here if it does resonate with you by liking this video you guys youtube see that you, you like it it resonates they push it through to a bigger audience so the video can grow so the channel can grow you guys we're at seventeen thousand already you guys are amazing thank you so much for your love and support Oh, you guys are amazing. But um, if it doesn't resonate, you guys, I will have a link in the description. It will be your playlist, okay? Let's see what's going on with you and your person. All right, Angel, what's going on for Taurus, please? What messages do we have for Taurus? We have Blackage here with the Queen of Swords. So somebody is not in speaking mode. Someone is not talking to someone. Someone has deleted someone from their lives here. There's no communication. Okay, you got a lot of messages. But something is coming through. All right, so we've got soulmate connection coming here. We have the Queen of Swords, King of Swords in the upright. All right. We have a second chance. This person wants a second chance with you. They can't come off as very young. I mean, uh, very logical. You know, they want you to know that, hey, they're there for you. No matter what, or no matter what you choose, they're still there for you. I feel like at this point, you're kind of burned out from this person, tired, beat up. But this person is still open to this relationship, still trying to fight for it. I feel like there's a control energy coming through here. Someone that is very manipulative, physically or mentally abusive as well for some of you. Someone that puts you down a lot, okay? They make you feel like you are not even worth it, like you're not even on their level, okay? But I feel like you moved on from this person because they're saying you moved on with someone else. And here's the emperor. So you moved on with a better person or you moved on, they're seeing you as the emperor. You moved on with an older energy. It could be in the physical, but it, couldn't, it doesn't have to be. It could be someone that is just a wise person. I feel like this is a better love for you. But again, I feel like your past energy, this person is very much thinking about you. Yes, they do have feelings for you as well. Um, but you are at a place where you are with someone that can give you a more stable, committed life for some of you. But your past is coming back. Yeah. King of Pentacles. Knight, I'm sorry, the Knight of Pentacles. We're going to take the Death. Pentacles. All right, so this this past love here is a very manipulative energy. I know that from the the emperor being here in reverse, very manipulative, very controlling, very um, physically abusive, mentally abusive. For some of you, doesn't have to be, but this person is very controlling, very stubborn, very set energy. Could be an Aries, okay, um, that you guys are with or sat. Could be a Leo, very fixed in their emotions. Um, my way or the highway kind of situation. But then we, this person is very manipulative when they don't get their way with you. They're very stuck, like they don't understand what's going on. Like, why are you not with them? Um, they haven't learned from the situation that you guys have been through together before and why you guys split up. They're still like, ah, uh, what happened? Um, but I feel like this person wants to come back into your life to help you to grow um, and give you balance back into your life because I feel like this person have took a lot from you. So let's see here. Okay, these cards are coming through, y'all. So we have the nine of um, cups here. Wow. Hm. 
Yeah. Okay. So this person backstabbed you. This person betrayed your trust. This person wasn't there for you. But I feel like you're at a point where you forgave that person and you're letting this go. Again, physical and mental issues here. Okay. That this person put you through physical and mental issues that this person put you through and you had to heal from this person. Okay. From your past. I do feel like they, um, they feel like you are what you are everything that they ever wanted. Okay. I feel like they believe that you are their person, their soulmate, their, um, their wish fulfillment. Okay. Because they do want to be successful with you. Okay. In this nine of cups here, they do have a lot of love for you and a lot of emotions for you. Uh, they do want a new beginning as well. So this person is going to offer this. I feel like this person is going to, um, let you know this. Um, however, what they did in the past, you're never going to get the clarity that you desire and why they did it. And you know, they don't know why they did it. I feel like they just did what they did because of how they were raised. Okay. But you're never, you're never going to get clarity. So for some of you, um, you probably are thinking about divorce from this person if you're married. But I feel like most of you are mostly dating this person. And just know that with this situation, I feel like the two of um, pentacles is popping through now. This is um, indicating a third party. They're juggling two things here. They're not overwhelmed with this, so... Um, they're not ready to make a decision on this either. So they're coming back to you like, I got the four of, I just saw the four of um, pentacles. Very selfish energy here. So um, I just feel like they're not in a, a place where they want to make a decision between this two of pentacles, okay? They want to approach you and bring this into your life. Like they want a new beginning with you. <sighs> apology. The apology is not even going to sound correct. Okay. This person is hiding exactly how they feel about you. Uh, especially with this two of pentacles being here. I feel like somebody's losing faith in this relationship. Why is this page of cups in reverse? And why is this? Yeah. Why is this page of cups in reverse, please? Page of cups in reverse. Why? Hmm. Wow. Because you made a decision. Hmm. You don't want to be with this person anymore with the judgment here and the three of pentacles. You don't want to be with them anymore. So they're hiding back their, their apology or making it half fit where they're blaming you saying, Hey, I'm sorry, but you have to take responsibility too of this situation. You know, why is this judgment in reverse? Because the lies and betrayal. You don't believe nothing this person tells you. And I feel like you are going under investigation as well. Yeah, secrets. <laughs> this person is holding back. This person is stuck into something. This person could be dealing with drug addiction, sexual addiction, or drinking addiction. Even a toxic family, they p could be stuck in a, uh, a toxic family, have toxic friends from childhood. But the way they were raised, you guys, they have a lot of issues. This is what I'm getting. But on the back of the deck, I do see the five of pentacles here. Which, you know, for some of you, this person left you for someone else. Um, and you had to pick up all the pieces, Okay probably left you in debt, kicked you out. And you have to put an end to this five of cups here. I'm sorry, not the five, the 10. Yeah, you're cutting off all communication. This person made a huge mistake. This is a loss. They're not even happy. Look at this. They're not happy being without you. There's a loss. The mistake had happened with this in the moon. I feel like you're cutting off all form of communication with this person. This person hurts you, but they're watching you. For some of you, you might be getting a divorce. And again, the apology is in reverse. Okay? Yeah. Taurus, this is what I see for you. I hope it resonates. If it does, you know what to do. Like this video. Give this video a big thumbs up. If not, um, I will have a link in the description. Um, it will be your playlist. All right? Love you guys, and I'll see you guys in your next one. Bye, guys.